Good. All right, awesome, cool. Hello. So uh, today we're going to talk about radioactive decay, um, alpha decay, beta plus, beta minus decay, field diagram here. And I am actually going to hand it over to Ali and Raha, who are both in Professor Duffy's section. Um, for PY, PY 106, Physics 2. Okay, so, Ali Raha. Okay, what, the, what in the world is alpha, <laughs> beta plus, beta minus decay? Okay, so I'll explain alpha first. Okay. okay. So alpha is losing a helium. which basically just means you lose two protons and you lose two neutrons and that's you lose why. two protons you lose two neutrons yep okay cool let's do some, something real quickly i'm just gonna bring this board up um because i don't think they know what two down two left really means yet. yeah exactly so let's talk about this part. okay so, so as i was saying for the alpha you lose a helium and it gets shot out, which is where the decay comes from. So that causes your atomic mass to decrease by four and your- And why four, since it's, since it's helium? Why four? Yeah, why four? Because the mass, right? Mm -hmm. The atomic mass of helium is four. Yeah, exactly. two protons, two neutrons. And then perfect. your atomic number goes down by two because you lose two protons. Atomic number, which is, yeah, perfect. Oh, yes, atomic yep, number. perfect, okay. Next part, um, how do you know what beta minus is without looking at the board? You know beta minus because you have to rationalize that oh. the nuclei <laughs> turns into a proton yeah. and an electron. electron. Because it's beta minus and in beta minus you're shooting out an electron. electron. So in order to produce an electron... The neutron becomes a proton and electron. Exactly. Uh, so the protons... Stays in the nucleus, yeah. the electron gets it shut out. In the system. And that's why you get an increase in your atomic number by one. Proton, yeah. neutron becomes proton, electron, electrons get shot out, proton stays in the nucleus, atomic number increases by one, yep. But atomic mass stays the same. Stays the same because the neutron just got converted. Yeah, yes. into the proton, yeah. Perfect, awesome. Plus decay. How so you know what that beta is? Beta plus decay. This time without, without looking. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah. Instead of shooting out an electron, you're shooting out a positive electron, which is a positron, which yeah. is the reason why the proton gets neutralized into mm -hmm. a new. Uh, the proton gets neutralized into a neutron because you kicked out what made it positive in the first place. Exactly. Proton converts into a neutron. Yeah. So whatever made the proton positive is shot out. Yeah. And that thing was a positron. positron and that's why it's called yep. beta beta plus. plus decay nice and the awesome. atomic number decreases by one atomic number decreases by one because you're losing a proton when it turns into a neutron you're losing a positron you're losing a atomic number goes down by one because the proton becomes a neutron yeah 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 and then atomic mass stays the same because you're Proton, proton is just a neutron now, which yeah. is the yep. same way. Mm -hmm. Yep, nothing, nothing big left for a nucleus. Exactly. Yep, so that's alpha, beta, decay made easy. Next, we're gonna go over the eel diagram over here. Oh, that's nice, that's what I call it. I think Duffy calls it the 
Carmi soon. Uh, yeah, he does. <laughs> yeah. All right. So uh, to come check out part two. We're gonna go over that real quickly and make it easy for you guys. If you like this, like this video, make sure you like it down there. And if you want to support this video, make sure you check out my Patreon page or go made easy down there in the description. Okay. Thanks, guys. Thank <laughs> you.